Hey guys, we're back and we're gonna go after them bluegills today and maybe some crappie or maybe vice versa. We're gonna give them both a try. We're gonna be using that beetle spin today and we're gonna give the night crawlers a try. See which what, what they want today. Let's see what we can do. I'm trying to be sneaky here. My cork come loose. There we go. There he is. Oh yeah. Not too bad of a fish either. He's a pretty good one. Oh yeah. He's not a great big giant, but he's a good, he's a good bluegill. We'll take him. See what we got right out there in the middle. That might be a bedding spot right there. Can tell the debris kind of moved around. Oh, yeah, he had it all the way under, and I was, I guys, I was looking at something else, <laughs> and he took it completely under. Well, pay attention if you want to catch him. I sure missed him. But we're going to try to give him another try. He took it all the way under too. I, I just wasn't watching. I was looking at something else, but guess what? Here we go. That got his attention. Now, is he want it or not? There he is. Oh man, good little fighter. <laughs> well, he's not a giant, but he was a, a fun fight. Pretty little bluegill. Later. There she goes. Oh, not a bad one. Oh yeah, that's that's a pretty decent one. Yeah, that's a. Uh, ouch. I guess that's a a red ear and bluegill combined. I think that's what that is. See his ear. What do you think, guys? Shell cracker. We'll take it. <laughs> Gosh, dog. Look at that, guys. That stupid snake coming under my coat. Scared the crap out of me. <laughs> oh, oh man that looks like a dynamite bluegill spot right there oh he's there <laughs> i was gonna say it looks good he's a little guy i'm about to lose my cork there we go yeah, he's a little guy, but he was fun. Pretty little bluegill. Okay, later. Knock, knock. Anybody up there on that flat spot? Maybe not. Thought it would be. All right, let's see what we got here. And he's there. <laughs> Real quick on that one. Yeah. Oh yeah, he's a little better. A little better fighter. Oh. Yeah, 
He's a small one, but a uh, smaller later. Give this brim pole a break. Get the old beetle spin rolling. See if we can't find us a crappie now. I got three or four brim. I might as well see if I can catch a crappie. There he is. Oh man. Holy cow. I need my net. That's a pretty good one. If I can get him in here. Oh man. Yeah. Easy guy. Man. Wow. That's a pretty black crappie. And it's a pretty good one. Let me get this uh, hook out of him. Easy guy. Man, that's a pretty one. I bet he's close to a pounder. I might as well give him a try. I ain't seen a good one in a while, so I've been hammering them brim or trying to. Oh yeah, he's 1.4. He's a pounder. A good one. Yes, sir. Let's see how thick he is. Oh yeah, he got a good solid back. They're healthy. We'll take him. There he is. Oh yeah, this is a good... Oh! Oh! Oh man, I didn't hook him good enough. That hurt. That hurt. Oh yeah. Pretty good one. <laughs> yeah. He's not as big as that last one, but he's a good crappie. I'm gonna have to get the uh, pliers. I can see that already. Easy guy. Alrighty. Here we go. Yeah, that's another good eater. We'll take him. Guys, this is my beetle spin setup. I put me a gold willow leaf blade on there. A 1 16th ounce jig head hook, size number four. A black bobby garland baby shad jig and a little crappie bite. We got a little bump. We're gonna try it again. Wake up everybody, there he is. Oh yeah. Oh, it's a little bass. A little bass. You chasing my crappie off. Oh yeah. Later. Wow. There he is. <laughs> what we got here? A little old another little bass. Well, he actually helped me get it out from that stick because it was hung there and he popped it right off of that stick. A little old guy. Later.